Hello students, GateEyes PC Online Question welcomes you and today we will discuss about guidance video related to your engineering mathematics and already just I suggested my old student which book just very important and how you should just prepare for like uh, which books uh, related to your engineering mathematics already just one video just I suggested okay books related to your mathematics I am just again providing a link for uh, just uh, for that video in the description of this video okay so just go to this description and again see that video okay which book is just very important related to your engineering mathematics so already just I suggested and uh, if already just you brought like those books and everything like you just already seen those videos I need to suggest guys how you should prepare I need to first of all I need to suggest because of maximum number of students just have fear of this engineering mathematics I need to I, I am just telling a truth here engineering mathematics contain this calculus part okay this calculus part is just 40% in syllabus okay means if you see like calculus part if you just uh, pick a calculus part from engineering mathematics that will contain your 40 percent part and this subject like calculus part is very hard for a student okay because of like uh, uh, maximum number of topics you will just see here and guys this is the truth guys only 20 to 30 percent questions mean in in your gate or in ies exam if they are asking question okay if you are they are asking question okay only 20 to means out of 10 question only two to three questions from this calculus part and generally one to question directly from these topics i am suggesting you should read in calculus part so everything this guidance video just i am telling here whatever the topics i am telling you just read because of student have a negative mindset like mathematics is big subject how to read because of it will not take time and i need to suggest guys you should give equal priority to this subject engineering mathematics as well as your reasoning and aptitude because of these subjects are like uh, very important play very important role in your selection if you just select and uh, if you will get good rank your engineering mathematics marks and your reasoning aptitude marks are very very important okay so you should read daily these types of subjects also okay whenever like you are reading your technical four hour five hour and your uh, gs part like two three hour you should also put this one hour subject for your mathematics as well as reasoning and aptitude okay so this this is going to be like uh, our strategy related to our this subject engineering mathematics now sir these topics i should i should read okay first of all i need to suggest guys if you like uh, from those students like engineering mathematics is just very easy you just read all uh, like syllabus okay all syllabus but sir some student like uh, have fear sir how i suggest uh, uh, like i want like a proper uh, like very very important topics just suggest me sir okay if you are like from top student you can just go to everywhere okay like every syllabus you can just follow but this video just for those guys who want like sir which topics are very important first of all i need to suggest guys i just divided this engineering mathematics into basically six topics first is just known as linear algebra second calculus third differential equation fourth your complex variable fifth are numerical methods six your probability and random variables okay so this is going to be like your six topics are there i need to suggest guys this linear algebra very very important topic this topic every student should read okay if anyone just ask me sir in engineering mathematics i i want to just uh, read only one single topic okay i don't have time or i don't have understanding of this mathematics i need to suggest guys this perfect topic i i give this priority to this subject linear algebra only basic matrix concepts are there types of matrix properties are there how to find determinant like what are the operations and property of determinant how to find inverse or square of matrix what is the linear equations uh, of matrix eigenvalues how to find eigenvectors rank of matrix these topics are very easy and you can a simple student can understand all those topics from book okay so i need to suggest guys you should prepare all topics properly this engineering algebra like linear algebra is a very very important topic for your gate as well as your IES exam okay so these topics you should understand you should just read properly all questions you should practice like for example you are reading like algebra matrix you should read and all one two examples you should solve properties of matrix users you just read what are the properties of this matrix what types of special matrix just again like solve four to five questions related to that topic okay so this topic is very very important second topic you just ask me sir calculus and sir if you just see this calculus out of 40 percent syllabus is here okay means sir if you like mathematics have 100 percent syllabus 40 percent only calculus remaining part only 60 percent okay and 80 percent dialect equations from this 60 percent part only only 20 percent questions just ask from this calculus okay because of sir this calculus is just very big okay and it will take very big time for a student i need to suggest guys 
if you are reading calculus part i am suggesting if you can able to like you have sufficient time if you can able to just uh, like read all calculus part you can go but sir this topic calculus only just i am telling here for those student who don't want to prepare like this much of time for this subject they want to just read very very important topics i need to suggest guys in calculus part just read limits continuity okay and differentiability okay like this is the very basic concepts are there how to like limits concepts are there like continuity or differentiability okay so this is going to be like a very basic uh, concepts related to functions just go for this topic second topic i need to suggest very very important maxima and minima okay so this maxima minima topic you should understand how to find maxima how to find minima everything just you should understand from calculus next topic from calculus partial differentiation okay like partial differentiation how we can just use like partial differentiation what are the properties everything just important so from calculus part these topics are only very very important generally if questions are 60 to 70 percent are probability is there these topics like uh, last year also same video just i given same topics i just provided and guys out of like uh, old topics your 90 percent questions from directly our topics what i just suggested last year you can just check my last year video also all topics the same topics just i suggested there and uh, you can just take is gs pre part syllabus okay or subject or like paper is there just take 90 percent questions directly what topics i just suggested directly questions from those topics okay so these topics are from this calculus part now sir differential equation differential equations very easy and very short part for this mathematics so you should just read total differential equation complex variable again a very short topics you just read all topics here now sir numerical methods and your probability and random variables are small small topics okay so in this part like numerical methods are again like very short so you should just read like all methods of numerical methods this probability and random variables again like important but sir you should just read this probability part total because of in your reasoning and aptitude also we have probability permutation combination okay so everywhere you will just see same concept okay so you should just read this probability and permutation combination okay and guys you can just go for random variables also if you have understanding if you have timing then you can just go for this random variable if you are going for gate exam this random variables are very very important okay but if you are going for ies exam this probability only sufficient for you guys okay so this is going to like six parts and you should just read this all six part properly from our mathematics subject and next we will see some student wants sir i should not uh, i don't want to just uh, read this mathematics subject because of this subject is very hard or i don't uh, i i am i am from diploma student or i don't uh, understand this mathematics subject for those student i am telling very very important topic okay these topics five topics you should read properly guys you should not left okay i need to suggest linear algebra complex variables differential equations numerical methods and limits and maxima minima how to find this limits and maxima minima these five topics you should read okay only 20 30 pages uh, like basic short notes you can just uh, create from this uh, this five topics and you can just read for gate as well as your ies exam this is going to be like basically i am not suggesting all question you will get from there because of if you want to left this subject engineering mathematics okay but sir this five sub five topics will cover your 70 to 80 percent part of this engineering mathematics because of these topics are very very important for your exam if you go to go through like last year papers of ies or last through last year papers of your uh, gate exam you can just see these topics are very very important okay means sir 70 to 80 percent slavers like uh, questions you will get like maximum to maximum time from these topics only okay so i need to suggest guys if you don't uh, if you want to just left uh, this engineering mathematics these subjects like these topics are very easy you don't need much concentration here some basic basic concepts are there, like some definitions some theories there just apply that theory and uh, you can easily grasp all concepts are there okay so this is our guys basically six topics are there you should just read properly all topics linear algebra just highest priority after that complex variable differential equation numerical methods all four you should just put any priority okay if you are preparing for mathematics or not or like if you are preparing very highly for mathematics these four topics you should just put your 100 percent okay definitely if you are putting this 100% here definitely you will get good marks in your engineering mathematics so this is going to be like our last video for this uh, uh, mathematics guidance video and uh, next you will get uh, for reasoning and aptitude so thank you guys for watching this video thank you